Hi friends and welcome to another virtual summer camp video. Today I'm going to be teaching you how to make your own sundials. So what you'll need in order to do this activity is a paper plate, um, a pencil or a pencil crayon but it needs to be sharp, some tape, and a marker. You're also going to need a clock because you're going to need to know what time it is and a space outside to do the rest of this activity. So once you have all the materials together, we can get started in making our sundial. So the first thing you're going to do is you're going to take your paper plate and put it serving side down so that uh, the bottom of the plate is facing up. Then you're going to take your pencil crayon or sharpened pencil and you're going to just stick a hole right in the middle of your um, paper plate. Should be something like this. Then you're gonna take the eraser side or bottom side of the pencil and just um, stick it in that hole. If you need to make your hole a little bit bigger, because mine's not quite big enough, just push it through. But then you're gonna take the back end of your um, pencil crayon or pencil and put it in your sundial like this. If you want, you can use some tape um, just to make sure it's in there a little bit more securely. You can put it on either side. There's no real best way of securing your um, pencil, but you just wanna make sure it's nice and um, tight on your side. So I'm gonna put it in the bottom. Once it's secure, you have finished making um, your sundial. The next step is to wait um, until the next hour. So right now it's about 10.15, so I'm gonna wait until 10.50, and then we're gonna find a place outside. So um, let's wait and do that. So once it's like 10 to whatever hour you're gonna start this at, so right now it is 10.50, um, you're gonna go outside, you're gonna find a space, and you're gonna set your uh, sundial on the ground. If you want, you can take your tape and um, tape it down to the ground a little bit because we need it to be uh, nice and secure so that it doesn't blow away. If you have pebbles or rocks, you can put them on the outside um, because once we have it set, we're just gonna leave it outside all day. So I'm gonna tape this down. So once it is the hour on the dot, so it is now 11 o'clock, you're gonna take your black marker and you're gonna draw a line and mark off where your shadow is from your, um, from your pencil crayon or pencil that's in the middle. Once you draw your line, you're just gonna write um, the time right next to it. So this is 11, so I'm just writing 11 o'clock next to it. And then we're gonna leave it. In an hour when it's 12 o'clock or the next hour from whenever you have decided to do this, we're going to come back out again. So now we're going to wait. Um, so it is now 12 o'clock and as you can see, um, the shadow has moved a little bit from where it was at 11 o'clock. So what we're going to do is we're just going to take our marker again. I lost my original Sharpie so I have a different one, but we're going to take our Sharpie and we're gonna draw another line and just write 12 o'clock. And then you're gonna do that for every hour until you have 12 different ticks around your plate. So unfortunately, I don't have enough time to show you guys what it would look like if you had all 12 of your um, marks on your sundial. But as I said, go out every hour and mark on your sundial where your, um, where the shade from your pencil is. And once you have all 12 marks, then you have your completed sundial and you'll be able to tell the time using uh, just your uh, paper plate and your pencil. Um, I hope you guys enjoyed. Um, keep an eye out for our videos released later this week.